Good to see you. Hey, I'm Tolgan, herald to Countess Narina Carvain here in Bruma. She requests your company at your earliest convenience. Countess Carvain would prefer if you speak to her in person. She also said to present you with this stipend as a taste of things to come. My lady holds court from 8 in the morning until 6 in the evening each day. That would be the best time to see her. The Countess is in attendance from 8 o'clock. If you wish to seek audience with her, I heard you helped the guard close that oblivion gate. What can I interest you in? I... Be seeing you. I'm Olfen. What can I interest you in? Another s I'm sure all of Bruma joins me in saluting your help in keeping the hordes of Oblivion at bay. Let's do business. That's a fair deal. That's a fair deal. That's a good deal. You drive a hard bargain. Come back. Be seeing. Yes? Have a look around. You won't find better prices in all Tamriel. That seems a fair price. Thank you. Goodbye.
Have you helped? Good work. Captain Bird and his guardsmen should be able to handle any additional gates. But the Bruma Guard cannot defend the city indefinitely. The Daedra of Oblivion are innumerable. The guardsmen of Bruma are not. We need to gather what allies we can before Bruma is hopelessly besieged. If the Mythic Dawn manages to open a great gate here, the city will need a stronger garrison for there to be any hope of defending it. You should speak to the rulers of the other cities of Cyrodiil, as well as the Elder Council. Ask them to send aid to Bruma before it is too late. Martin made some progress on the Mysterium Zarxes while you were gone. You should speak to the rulers of Cyrodiil as soon as possible. The danger to Bruma is growing by the day. I figured out another item needed for the ritual, to open the portal to Cameron's Paradise. The second item is the counterpart to the first, the blood of a divine. This was a terrible puzzle to me. Unlike the Daedra Lords, the gods have no artifacts and do not physically manifest themselves in our world. How then to obtain the blood of a god? But Joffrey solved it. The blood of Tiber Septum himself, who became one of the divines. This is a secret remembered only by the blades. Passed down from one gram. Be sure to speak to Joffrey. So, Martin wants you to recover the armor of Tiber Septim. I wish there was another way. The armor is in the shrine of Tiber Septim, in the catacombs beneath the ruins of Sankator, a holy place once. But Sankator became evil long ago. No one has returned from the shrine of Tiber Septim for many lifetimes. I do not know. The catacombs of Sankator were sealed by the first Grand Master of the Blades. The four mightiest blades of Tiber Septim's day, Elaine, Valdemar, Relus, and Kaznar, went to Sankator and never returned. Here, this is the key to Sankator's outer door. I fear I am sending you to your death, but we have no other choice. You must succeed. Keep your heart true and your eyes open. From the blades, did you say? Joffrey sent you? What's this about? Quickly now! This is terrible news. Under normal circumstances, I would dispatch a legion or two to Bruma immediately. But the circumstances are not normal, are they? I've been pleading for troops for Cyrodiil for weeks, but the generals assure me that the entire Imperial army is already fully committed. Besides, I'd have a full-scale political crisis on my hands if I tried to pull any troops out of the provinces. I'm sorry, but the cities of Cyrodiil will have to fend for themselves for the time being. Please excuse me. I have things to attend to. Remember.
You need something special? May I interest you in some of my fine wares? That's a good deal. Another satis... Come see me anytime, friend.
What? 